Good morning. Today we're here at Kroger Marketplace. We're going to go and check out some of the prices, some of the things you guys have asked about, and check the shelves. Let's get to it. Okay, since we walk into Kroger Marketplace here, another deal that I wanted to point out again this week is the five pound bags of russet potatoes. They are $1.99 uh, just on sale, no extra purchase required. Regular price, $4.29 on these. Also, they have the 10 pound bags for $3.99, so an even better deal on those. Another great deal are the Gala apples and Granny Smith apples and Fuji. They are all three ninety nine dollars cents a pound this week. So a couple days ago, we came to Kroger and went over a lot of the produce sales for the week. We went over a lot of the Thanksgiving sales for the week. Uh, so if you happen to miss that video, I will leave that in the video description box below of this video so you can check that out after this video. I said video a lot. We'll go over some of the big deals. We'll go over the turkeys again. Uh, Kroger Marketplace usually has a lot more. We noticed the Kroger we went to the other day didn't have that many. And we're going to check these out. I'll kind of go over how this sale works because there was a little bit of confusion on that. They definitely have a lot more ham than I've seen at any Kroger as of late. However, these prices are absolutely ridiculous. Um, I'm not going to go over all of them here, but they do have the crunchy gray glazed spiral ham. Somebody asked about it from Smithfield. $4.49 a pound. They have the Cumberland Gap ham, which somebody else asked about. It's the only place I've seen it this year. Uh, three seventy nine a pound. This is always a little pricey, but yeah, double check here. It says unit price. Okay, on sale price thirty two twenty two for this one at three seventy nine a pound. But I, I do have to say, I'm kind of surprised that these hams aren't cheaper. Maybe they'll get a little cheaper toward Christmas. I'm not sure this year. Uh, they do have the pork shank uh, portions of the cooks hams here, $1.79 a pound. That's about the best deal we've seen anywhere, unfortunately. The only Kroger that I've seen where they've broken it down in some like drum legs and drum thighs. Uh, so this is $2.49 a pound for the drum legs, bringing three legs out to $5.05. .05. And these are honeysuckle. We did see some at Walmart a couple weeks ago. It's a little more pricey than this. Uh, let's see, thighs dollar ninety one a pound. Or wait a minute, no, two seventy nine a pound. This one weighs one point nine one pounds. Five dollars and thirty three cents for this. They do have their top sirloin on sale this week, eight ninety nine a pound. These prices, you know, it, it's crazy. Like th this was seven ninety nine a pound, uh, right right at the beginning of summer. Regular price now, regular price is ten ninety nine a pound. On sale, eight ninety nine a pound, but. Seems a bit much for the, one of the cheapest quality meats. They do have their bone-in center cut pork chops here, $3.49 a pound. I do have to say these look pretty good. Regular price on these now, a whopping $5.49 a pound. So last week it was the 80% lean. This week they've lowered to the 73% lean, which I don't know. I'm not a big fan of that, uh, especially in the tube here. Sold in three pound package at $8.37, two, $2.79 a pound. Regular price of this is $11.99 for three pounds. So it's a good deal. It's a good deal, but I don't know. $8.37, yeah, I can't argue that. That's a great deal. They do have the Kroger Italian sausages, part of the digital coupon this week, $2.99. Regular price on these now, $5.99. $5.99, which is actually a little lower. They've tried it was $6.49 regular price. But this week, digital coupon, $2.99 for one package. That's pretty good. So if you want to get right to most of the Thanksgiving offers that Kroger's has, the sales, which you know we have been finding some better deals at some other places, but still okay deal. 12 ounces for $2. Uh, for a 12 ounce thing of the Heinz gravy. We, we got some comments on this, so I thought I'd go over it again. Um, $2.18 at Walmart for the 18 ounce thing of the gravy. So much better deal. Also, if you have a Sam's Club membership, we went there yesterday and they have three of the 18 ounce things of turkey gravy, roasted turkey gravy, uh, for less than $5. It was $4.80 something. So yeah, much better deal there. But again, we went over all this on Wednesday, 
So I will leave that video in the description box below if you want to check that out. They have all of the Hillshire Farm rope smoked sausage on sale this week, $3.50 if you use your Kroger Plus card. Um, it's, this says this is just the, the Polska kielbasa, but it is all of them on this deal. Two for seven, but you don't have to buy two. You can just buy one, use your Kroger Plus card, brings it down to $3.50. Regular price, $4.79. There's been a lot of comments on cheese lately and how expensive it's gotten and I, I agree so when we find a sale like this we want to make sure we uh, get it. They have a digital coupon for all the two pound bags of cheddar cheese Kroger brand uh, for $5.99 this week. Two pounds. $5.99 that is down from $7.99. With this deal you can use up to five times. So you can really stock up here this week. Two pounds. Only the two pound bags not the one pound. And that does include mozzarella and Colby Jack. So Colby Jack, mozzarella, sharp cheddar, and mild cheddar, if they have it. Uh, the two pound packages for $5.99, that's a great deal. And this is what I love about Kroger Marketplace is usually they'll just have it all laid out here for you on a platter. This is each one of the deals right up front here in center. Uh, also the 32 ounce bar uh, cheese here, two pounds, solid cheese. $5.99 as well. They have Philadelphia cream cheese on the buy six or more, save 50 cents each deal. Brings it down to $2.49 a brick. Regular price, $3.29 for one eight ounce brick of Philadelphia cream cheese. With this sale, buy six or more, save 50 cents. You do not have to buy six of these. It's all mix or match on this participating deal. So you can buy a couple of these, couple of anything. As long as you get to six or more, uh, then everything after that will be this price at the bottom here. Why pay $4.99 for Kroger butter, which is pretty crazy expensive right now when you can get Land O'Lakes, the one we always get comments on for $3.99 on the digital coupon this week. You can use up to five times. Five times, guys. Uh, it's a great deal. Uh, this has constantly gone up in price lately. Regular price, $6.49, $3.99 on the digital coupon. You can't beat that. They also have the Land O'Lakes Spreadable here. Uh, spreadable butter, $3.99 on sale, down from $4.79. No uh, digital coupon required. Just use your Kroger Plus card, get it for $3.99. Something I missed the other day, and we've gotten a lot of comments on it lately. Can't believe I missed this one, or they just didn't have it at the other Kroger. That's pretty possible. Uh, the Red Gold Petite Dice Tomatoes. Got uh, some different kinds here of the red gold, 79 cents on the buy six or more, save 50 cents deal. So this is another item you can mix and match with that Philadelphia cream cheese or anything that you see on this participating deal. There's been a lot of talk on yogurt lately and how expensive it's getting, and I completely agree. $1.50 for one of these Chobani things is ridiculous. Um, you can get the four packs on the buy six or more deal for $3.49 this week, down from $5.29. Now again, I will mention Sam's Club. If you have a Sam's Club membership, uh, you get these. It comes out to 91 cents a piece. You get 16 of them, less than a dollar. That's the way to go. Um, but if you don't have that, 3.49 on the buy six or more deal. That's not bad. Great deal on Oikos here. Uh, 79 cents a piece when you buy the six or more deal. Again. You don't have to buy six of these, but I recommend it. 79 cents a piece. That's the cheapest we've seen in a long time. Regular price, $1.29 a piece on these. So, wow, that's that's a great deal. We got another comment on Jell-O, and I know Jell-O has just kind of skyrocketed lately. Um, it is on the buy six or more deal, though, this week. So I thought I'd point it out. $2 for a four-pack of Jell-O. Regular price, $2.69 for one, which is insane if you ask me I, th I think two dollars is crazy but it is what it is just wanted to point it out uh, we have gotten a lot of comments on this in the past uh, with the prices increasing I remember these were $1.99 or $2.19 uh, not that long ago Pillsbury Grand's biscuits are $2.49 on the buy six or more deal regular price $3.29 a can that's the highest that we have seen outside of a convenience store. So $2.49, it's about as good of a deal as we're gonna get right now. 
They got some carts. They're getting ready to put some stuff away here. I did want to point out, we are seeing some inconvenience stickers on Cheez-Its again. Now, they are on sale, $2.49 a box. Um, with the buy six or more, save 50 cents each deal. Regular price of these, $3.79 for some. And I see some down there that are $4.29. Crazy. Same goes with Ritz crackers. I do believe uh, we went over this the other day but it's too good of a deal 249 right now part of the buy six or more down from 399 so you're saving a dollar 50 by doing this deal i mean that's that's a good you know it's it's as good as it's gonna be i remember this time last year ritz crackers were 279 regular price so to get them for 249 you're getting them a little less than what the regular price was last year we are always getting comments on crackers, and I was going to go over this the other day, but we had covered a lot of the holiday things, and it took up a lot of time. But just wanted to say, uh, they do have the Zesta crackers, which we get comments on, $3.29. No coupon required, just your Kroger Plus card down for $3.79. But here, we got the Nabisco Premium Saltines, $2.99 a box on this buy six or more deal, down from $4.29. $4.29 for these for regular price, that's crazy. $2.99 this week, though. We get a lot of comments on these, so get to Kroger's. Okay, so I wanted to double-check on the Cheez-Its here because we do get a lot of comments on Cheez-Its. The ones that were regular price of $4.29 are the snapped bags right here. And these are down to the same price, $2.49. We've gotten comments on these, too. Looks like they have all the different brands. Another important deal that I went over the other day, but I was passing this end cap. Thought I would point it out again. Cream of mushroom and cream of chicken, 89 cents a can on the digital coupon this week. That does not include cream of celery or cream of potato. It is only the mushroom and cream of chicken, unfortunately, but it is 89 cents a can. Coca-Cola, Pepsi, or 7-Up products mix or match six-pack of the 16.9 ounce plastic bottles, $2.79 on the digital coupon, and you can use up to five times. So... You can download the digital coupon. You can get a six pack of Coke here, $2.79. All of them mix or match, doesn't matter. Um, that's pretty good considering regular price now is a ridiculous $5.49. An okay deal for holiday prices, I guess. They do have the 12 packs of uh, Coca Cola, Pepsi, or 7 Up mix or match, three for $12.88. Now, as to where that's an okay price, I, I don't know if it's going to be any cheaper next week we are less than today is friday november 11th so we are less than two weeks now from thanksgiving so i don't know if their next sale is going to be any cheaper i have a feeling it might um but i don't know so if you see this and this kind of deal you may want to go ahead and get some and then if it goes on sale again next week just come back and get some more because we never know what the deals are going to be until they release the ad we got a lot of comments on these four pack of Simple Truth Organic Beans. Wanted to point out they are on sale this week, $3.99 on all of them. On all the four packs, that's a good deal. Well, they only got black beans and what are these? Garbanzo beans. So they've got the two four packs of those. Uh, $1.25 each of the other kinds that they have here. So no sale on these. It just says low price. They kind of fool you with that. Uh, $1.25. But again, for those of you who have watched the channel for a long time know when we see low price on here, that usually means that when they change the sticker, it's going to be a higher price. They do still have all of their Progresso soups on the buy six or more, say 50 cents each deal, bringing these down to $1.79. So almost a dollar off a can on the buy six or more. I mean, it's a good time to stock up. I know it's not as cheap as it was a couple weeks ago, but still an okay sale. $2.50 a can for Campbell's. Okay, so this Kroger's definitely has a lot more turkeys than the other Kroger's. Uh, now, this price on this Kroger turkey with the digital coupon comes out to 49 cents a pound. Now, you do have to spend $25 to get that deal extra to get it for 49 cents a pound. Plus, it is on, on a digital coupon that you can only use once. Now, one thing I did not mention the other day that somebody thank you to who brought this up on the channel now this is kroger or honeysuckle turkeys frozen grade a 49 cents a pound on that deal 69 cents a pound 
without the digital coupon. Don't believe you have to spend, yeah, you don't have to spend the extra $25 with that. Uh, weekly sale price without your digital coupon is 69 cents per pound, per pound with your card. Does say limit one, and I don't know if that's clear about the $25 purchase. So I don't know if you have to purchase $25 with the 69 cents a pound. We're not very clear on that. Okay, so to clear some of that up, I went and got a manager and I talked to uh, the meat counter guy who was there putting them in. Uh, he said the 69 cents a pound is one you do not need the digital coupon for. No extra purchase required either, so you don't have to spend the $25. Now, Butterball is $1.49 a pound on sale. You can't look at the stickers because the stickers still say $1.99 a pound, so I was curious about that one. It is $1.49 a pound, still more expensive than pretty much anywhere we've been in the last week or so. Aldi was $1.07 a pound, uh, Walmart was $1.19 a pound, I believe, or no, that was Target. Walmart was $1.18 a pound, so cheaper at those places. Also, from what I gathered, the $0.69 cents a pound also includes honeysuckle turkeys. Now, it says that under the $0.49 cents a pound, too, but there was no, no clarity in that, so I would just assume that it's $0.69 cents a pound. Let me know down in the comments if you know for sure. It's confusing the way they have it worded out. So I don't know if it's terrible advertising or genius. The way it was worded out over there, every line is under another one. So you really can't tell. There's a, I, I would explain it over there, but there's a lot of people getting turkeys right now, so I don't want to get in their way. Um, but the way it's worded out, it, it makes it look like the 69 cent turkeys are, have the $25 purchase too because that's right underneath there. That is not the case. 69 cents a pound turkeys, honeysuckle and Kroger. Of course, they're out of honeysuckle. Um, the 69 cents ones do not include the $25 purchase. Really confusing. But anyway, we do have some canned fruit here, which we've been getting a lot of comments on. Uh, mixed reviews on Kroger's canned fruits. One thing I will say is it does look like they're kind of condensing this some, and I think it's just because they're just not getting it in. They're not getting in a lot. Also, uh, their uh, prices went up to two forty nine here. Thank you to who mentioned that they were two thirty nine. Um, some of the Kroger ones here have gone up to a dollar fifty nine. Uh, some of them are a dollar thirty nine. They're kind of mixed all over the place here. They do have the Dole pineapple, uh, all the different brands here. For $1.49 on the digital coupon this week. Regular price on these, $2.79. So a good deal here. But yeah, if you find a canned fruit that you like, I recommend just buying it up. Don't worry too much about the price because it is. It's getting a lot lower. Lower and lower. Plus, look at all these mandarins here. All these are dented. So we've been getting a lot of comments on sugar being very hard to find again. Um, seems like it's just hit or miss all over the country we really don't know uh, we've seen where it's gone crazy up in price you know what's funny is the one that hasn't changed is the kroger cane sugar here in the pink bag that's been 349 while all the other ones have been going up so that is definitely something i would take a picture of uh to take up to the register in case it rings up differently but we've seen this at multiple krogers for 349 so it's probably the right price 449 for the four pound of domino which has gone up uh, it's been that for a couple weeks, but the big thing that I notice here, 10 pounds of the Domino Sugar, $9.99, yes, same price. Look at that sticker right there. We have not seen a sorry for the inconvenience sticker on the 10 pound bags of Domino Sugar, so keep that in mind. Wanted to do a quick look at some of the frozen vegetables here. I mean, it is still low on a lot of things, but I will say they are getting more of the run of the mill vegetables back in. They're getting, we saw where this was very low a uh, week, and even two weeks ago it was crazy low. And they, they could be getting bought up because of the holidays, but it's good to see that they've got these filled back in. These are the cheapest. $1.25 a bag is not cheap anymore. Um, even when they were a dollar a bag, that was more than what a lot of other places are. It's probably the most expensive for the name brand. Now I will say Kroger's frozen vegetables are really good we do like them but dollar 25 a bag we've been getting them at other places great value 84 cents a bag uh even at target good and gather brand 79 cents a bag that's the best deal we've seen i know a lot of people you know 
I'm <laughs> thinking of Target. Wouldn't buy frozen vegetables there. Uh, but that's where we've been getting them. It's good price and good quality. But we still have people that swear by bird's eye. And it does look like they have a little bit of a sale on some of these. Now, they really have. They've kind of just skyrocketed in price. Uh, some of these different things are a little more anyway, like the pasta and vegetables here. Uh, I've actually tried this before. The sauce Alfredo penne and vegetables. Or penny, however you like to say it. Uh, $229, uh, regular price $299 on the buy six or more deal. And there's a few different ones here. They do have the um, broccoli florets. Wow, they still don't have a price on that. They still don't have a price on that. That is funny. Like, and it's it's nowhere else, so I don't know. I don't know what this costs. Somebody was asking about this. And uh, yeah, 52 ounces of them, still no price tag. But like their super sweet corn down here, it is on sale for $1.59. Regular price, $1.69. Uh, they have the mixed vegetables here. What is this? Corn, carrots, and asparagus. Uh, on sale for $2.29 on the buy six and more. There are a lot of uh, deals on these this week, so you may want to check it out. But yeah, peas for even $2.29 on the deal here it still seems a bit much. They have the mixed vegetables here, part of that deal as well. $2.99 for this. Regular price, only 10 ounces. I'm sorry, but that's that's crazy. So the sale here for eggs is over. It is now $5.09. That is up from $4.89 just over a little bit of a week ago. Eggs have just gotten ridiculous. Um, we saw some good prices at Walmart. So I don't know. Let us know if your Walmart has gotten cheaper. Uh, hopefully that is a sign of things to come. I don't know, but... Uh, same with the 12 count eggs, 339. These were 329 just a couple weeks ago, and they just seem to keep going up here at Kroger. So I don't know. Um, I don't know. It's pretty expensive. 324 at Aldi. So that would be usually where I would think they would have the cheapest. Three dollars and twenty-four cents at Aldi, uh, and a 12 count of eggs at our Walmart is a little under um, three dollars. So the best deal is definitely Walmart this week. We're always getting comments on Daisy Sour Cream and how low it is in a lot of the stores. They do have in the container here, the medium sized container of it is on the buy six more deal, making these $1.99 a piece, down from $2.99. Now, going in hand in hand with that would be the cottage cheese. Or wait a minute. Yeah, no, okay, this is the Kroger Sour Cream. But yeah, okay, because I saw this in the end. The cottage cheese is the Daisy Cottage Cheese, $2.29 on the buy six or more. This is now. 329 regular price so a little bit of a better deal dollar off dollar off basically and the kroger sour cream is a little cheaper i don't know for 50 cents more i mean we get daisy anyway but for 50 cents more daisy we've tried the kroger sour cream not as good as daisy they do have the coffee mate refrigerated creamers on sale this week on the buy six or more uh down to 349 now regular price on these has shot up to 429 they were 399 not long ago 349 is an okay deal these days. We got some comments again on lactate milk. Just wanted to point out that it is on sale still on the buy six or more for the big jugs of it down to 549. That's a dollar off the regular price now at 649. So good deal on this. Plus they have. Well, that was our trip to Kroger Marketplace. You know, not the greatest sales being less than two weeks away from Thanksgiving. I, I hope that there's going to be some more sales in the uh, week before Thanksgiving. We're gonna check those out next week. Um, and it looks like Meyer is gonna be having some good deals too. Thank you to who pointed out a lot of the sales coming up at Meyer. We'll just have to see what Kroger's does. Hopefully they bring some of the holiday items down a little bit more because we're ultimately finding better deals in other places. Well guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. With all that being said, I am out and always remember the adventure is out there.